Welcome back. Time for some mobile latro. I think it's Bellatro. I have no idea how to say this game. Oh, this game's sweet. If you missed it the first time, this is a Poco roguelike that is currently uh, not out, but it does have a pretty robust demo that got updated somewhat recently. And we're going to try a run. Let's see if we can't die. We did a lot of dying uh, in the last few videos <laughs> that we played this game. So I'm going to go... I don't... I think I've won with this, and I think I've won with this. Actually, I think that can't be true. Let's, I, I've definitely won with the blue deck. So let's try this again. So yeah, the basic uh, thing is you play levels. In the demo, it's five and then a boss level on six. You play a small blind, a big blind, and then a boss blind. And you make money, buy cards, make poker hands. And you can do a bunch of different things to augment or manipulate your hands to try and score us enough points to... Beat the blind or the boss. I guess they're all blinds. The boss blind is also a blind. Uh, you can also skip blinds. If you skip this one, you get a voucher. Skip this one. Next boost. Uh, next shop is free, which is pretty sweet. Um, but we're not gonna skip. We might skip the next one. So otherwise, it's just especially early on. You have a deck of fifty-two cards, and you just build poker hands. <laughs> Pretty close to some here. You can discard. Your discards are here. You can discard X times. Full house seems pretty good. It was good enough. And then you get money. Money based on the blind. Uh, money for each hand you have left. So you can only play a set amount of hands per round. Uh, I think the only way to lose, actually, is to not hit the score required before you run out of hands. So... Uh, having some left does give you extra money, which makes sense. Obviously, it's easier to make the points when you have more hands played. And you do make interest. Uh, every $5, you make an extra dollar up to five extra dollars total. So up to 25 normally. I was on hand size. That's pretty good. <laughs> hand contains three of a kind. They're worth more chips. Chips is the blue side of this equation. Which is multiplied by your mult, which is your multiplier. 120 for a straight. I think we're actually going to buy this paintbrush. Hands is like one of the most powerful things you can have. It, seem, it feels like cards and boosters in next shop are free. I think we can skip and still beat the boss blind. One of the things about the boss blind is that you have to beat it to get access to the shop. Whereas I think that's not true for others. I think that's not true for the smaller blinds. But we do have an extra hand, which is again not an not a trivial buff. I'm gonna just play this hand as is actually. You can play an extra card if you want. It doesn't score if it wouldn't score like a normal hand, but what's left? We have an ace left. One ace left. A bunch of twos left. I'm trying to build another full house. We could keep the hearts. We have a decent number of hearts left. Let's go for the heart flush. Chop. Didn't hit. No kings left. One ace left. 25 cards left. Still lots of hearts left. I actually have the same number of hearts left. Let's just do this. One of those might have been a heart I needed. Oh, sorry. The other thing I like about this game is just the vibes are good. Okay, nice. That was enough. I was happy to play an extra hand there if I had to. Just wanted to play a high enough scoring hand. So these are free. Yes. So the voucher isn't free. That's okay. But both these jokers and these two packs are free. I guess I'm buying both of these. Because they're free. <laughs> I also sell, so I could make money if I need to, but I'll keep them for now. Jokers typically are the way you multiply your score. So this little window here, the red one. Um, and this giving some multiplier is fine. Uh, doesn't really matter what order I use this in, it feels like. I don't feel that strong, I will say. Creates a random joker. Kind of down for a random joker. Plus one discard. It's not bad. Decently powerful. 
Destroys two cards. Enhance two cards. Make one lucky card. Make a steel card. Make one card a different card. Could destroy and pick a suit. Could convert. Converting's a little safer. Gonna make this club. Left card into the right card. Gonna make this club a king of diamonds. Okay, good enough. Next round. I'm not feeling great about where we are. Kind of want to skip this. We'll see. I have to play this fight, I think, to even consider skipping. So, we'll play. Full house energy is there. This diamond flush also looks okay. Did hit the full house. First face card play gets molt, right? So, this will give... I don't know what this did. Oh, an ace isn't a face card. Fun fact. How many diamonds left? I have one extra diamond, remember? We'll just hunt for the diamond flush. Four? Four is close. Yeah, there's only four. I think the six matters. Cool. Okay, and that's where the malt comes from. All right, good enough. Definitely not feeling strong. 800 didn't feel too hard, but how much is the boss blown? Oh, I don't know, because I'm shopping potentially. Two malt already. More malt if I buy this. This is just plus 15 malt. Problem is if I skip, no, actually, okay. I think this is playable. So I'm gonna skip and then play this fight and hope that the banana is good enough to get me there. I don't really want these clubs. I think we're just chasing these diamond flushes, unfortunately. Not the most thrilling gameplay, but Oh my god. <gasps> that is a straight flush. Oh, that's good. <laughs> the nutter didn't break. Wow, that was a very good hint. Safe. Yeah, so if you didn't read. I don't know what the reference is, by the way, for the banana, but. Uh, plus 15 malt, which is a huge amount. One in eight chance it's destroyed at the end of the round. Every time you use it at the end, it might explode. But it didn't explode, so that's good. Oh, I have two deaths to use too. I like totally forgot that I had these, by the way. Holographic Joker, what do we got? Destroy it and earn three dollars. That is really strong. Level up straight flush. Okay. That's also good. I'm gonna buy this. Could buy this. Three dollars. Okay, I'm down to buy this. Oh no. Uh, maybe I wanted to use death first. Okay, we'll see. So my current plan is to make straights, it looks like. I can destroy cards until I can only have straights left. I don't know how easy that is, but it seems cool to try. So I have diamonds, and I'm trying to build, I guess, a straight flush with how this works. So let me discard... I have an extra discard too. This actually, this and this are playing well together. Oh yeah, also there's different rarities. I don't know what they all do, but holographic as you can see on the end there, here. Plus 10 malt. So this also is 10 malt. I think this way stacking makes sense. I will keep this seven. Oh, you can do that. I thought you could, because you can organize your cards like this, but you can also just move them over, which is nice. I didn't think about it, but it's a very straightforward but welcome quality of life thing. All right, so I'm going to discard this because we have... Yeah, we're going to destroy all our clubs slowly but surely. If the first discard of round... Oh, the round has only one card. Is All right, let me discard this. So I get $3 and it destroys. Is this the same round? Like, what if I discard this? 
No, okay. Must be the first per like game or whatever. If that makes sense. Okay, Discord. Seven, eight, nine, oh, ten. Alright, this is a good straight. That'll do. Yeah, that was a lot of points. Oh, that was enough. I should have tried to see if I could get this to work again, but I guess it doesn't really matter. Spades. Not really in spades. Going up to minus 20 in debt. It's kind of fun. Tarot cards. Kind of here for these right now. But I could fish for a new one. This seems pretty good, but I think I can buy it after the boss blind. And I think the interest is valuable enough to just wait. I don't think I'm skipping though. Her unused discard. Wow, that's a lot of money, but I think I actually need to, I think I need to fight to get this triggered. I wish this would tell me when it, if it only triggers once and if it already triggered, but whatever. Five, six, seven, eight is close. Five, six, seven, eight. I mean, I could just discard these two. I have so many draws here. Oh, exactly what I was looking for. Seven, eight. Hang on. Let's just go these kings, actually. I think this makes sense. No. Like this? This looks a little unhinged, but whatever. Seven, eight. Oh, goodness. Maybe I just play these. I'm going to say it's only the first one. And not all of them. Might need to chase this hot flush, actually. This straight is so juicy. Never mind. Ooh. That's good. Not exactly what I was looking for, but... It's good. Banana's still safe. 9, 10, 6, 7... No. Oh. There's no straight here. But this should be... Fine. I think it's good enough. Could have maybe gone for the diamonds instead, but yeah, that was worth enough. Banana's still safe. Getting a little spicy. This is pretty powerful, but it's kind of slow. No, I don't think I care about that. More tarot's. I mean, this is... A straight flush is going to go absolutely nuts, but I'm going to buy this. One more hand seems good. Hang what? I need to buy one of these? Maybe? Uh, I don't know. I feel like this is kind of greasy, but... Greasy? Greedy, but... Four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, it's a good start. Wait. Banana is safe. Those one face down after each hand played. Wish I knew what that meant. Kinda seems like these might all be diamonds. YOLO? Dang it. Okay, well thankfully we don't have to play too many hands. I'm just gonna... We'll have to discard something, right? I'm just gonna discard this. Oh, it has to be the first one? Oh, okay. I'm dumb. <laughs> That's fine. One, two, three, four. So I missed my chance to do that. I'll play this. I'll try and play this. Uh, spade flush. Almost the fancy flush, but not. I think this will be enough points though. I hope the banana doesn't break. Okay, good.
What a sentence, by the way. Hope my banana doesn't break. Some more Pataro. Not getting that much better from this point. Sells for six. That's so many. Could sell it before it explodes. Could sell this too. But kind of trying to make straights. This seems pretty good actually. Maybe I want a different Joker. Kind of annoyed at myself that I didn't read the other Joker more carefully, but it's okay. I think I'm gonna open this. I mean, this is pretty good. I could just sell this. Afraid of the banana dying for sure, but is what it is. This or something. Voucher. Rerolls the boss blind. Um. I don't think I care about that. Let's hold on to these. Wait. Okay. Didn't mess it up. Like, I have the extra discard, so it doesn't really cost me very much to do that, which is nice. Oh, well. Wow. Play this just to play it. Just to get it out of my hand. Still safe. 9, 10, Jack, Queen. I guess I can hold on to this 5. I really just want to hit the Giga Flush. Oh, I can't keep going. Okay, that's a shame. But this hand's still pretty good. Like, I'm not going to use my full cards until I'm absolutely slamming the fat flush. But I might not get a chance to, you know? I could just play these, because we're pretty close to hitting this straight. And two pair seems okay here. I have plenty of hands to play as well. That was one of the nice things about taking those vouchers early. My banana's definitely getting tested, though. Which, again, what a sentence. Ooh. Every time. I just want to know it's safe. Oh, the end of the round. Okay, so this is a round. One, like, hand isn't a round. The whole thing is a round. Okay, so it doesn't actually check until the very end. I did not know that. It also makes sense how this works now, which I also didn't know. Two random planets, and then two random planets again. Doesn't actually work. Yeah, that doesn't actually work. That's a shame. Um, Honestly, a just a regular card pack might be okay. I just need a diamond I can try to make a flush with. Never mind those. <laughs> um, I don't think rolling the boss blind is going to help me, but I think I'm going to have to get very lucky to win this game. I think the good news is if I get very lucky, it's going to be a really sweet win. Uh, One off Broadway. Let's actually go the other way. Oh. Learn from my mistake. All right. Keep the diamond jack, actually. Ten, jack, queen, king, ace. Nice. Yeah, banana's pretty good. I'm a little concerned about my ability to win this game. Two, three, four. Do I have a five of diamonds still left? No. I can't make this straight, which sucks. Pretty comfortably make a flush though. I'm just gonna play these. Play this as well. Yeah. I can't make this diamond straight flush though. Right? That card's just not in the deck right now. Yeah. I'm missing a five. Oh no, I'm not missing a five. Oh, never mind. I can make it. Let's go. Two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I just need to hit these two. 10, uh, these, that's good. We're fishing. 
I have one more discard left. These two. You keep the 10. Because then I have the other end as well, right? You have this whole end as well. All right. We're going for it. Wow. That's not it. <laughs> okay, we're just going to play high card, which is not good. I think we have one hand left, actually. Oh, no, we have a few more. We have so many diamonds. This is so greedy, but like... Two, three, four, five. I don't need this eight. This eight doesn't help me, right? Because it's just two, three, four, five. Just this six I'm looking for. Yeah. And then the ten connects. Oh, I can't get the jack. Oh. I wonder if I'd paid attention. All right. So this ten is out. Yeah. We just have to hit the six. That's our only out, actually. Otherwise, we hit a flush and hope that's enough. This is very spicy. Make a regular flush. Oh my goodness, we missed. How did we miss? Uh, the greed. All right, please be enough. <gasps> this is a straight flush. Oh my God, ace counts. I forgot. If this isn't enough because I didn't use my full cards, I'm going to be so mad. No. All right, well. A good reminder how the poker rules work. I don't think this run would have gone all the way, but I was excited to see what was happening there. I was kind of cooking. I haven't had a run yet where I've been able to really try and craft a deck, and that early Joker was really cool. All right, well, you live and learn, even in the Bellatro demo. Thanks for hanging out. Definitely going to do a few more runs of this on the channel, and probably way more when the full game actually comes out, but... Uh, this game's really sweet. You should definitely give it a try. You can wishlist it on Steam if you want. Um, otherwise, yeah, the demo's free. Check it out. Do recommend if you like Roguelikes, card games, or, I don't know, good vibes. This game has all that and more. Thanks for hanging out.